Yo, what is up guys? My name is Hacky and welcome to episode 28 of Garage Wars, the series where I showcase your guys' best modded garages. If you want to be in one of these two, just let me know you're subbed and you have a cool modded garage to showcase. Now, here's today's notification shout out up on the screen. If you want to win one too, just make sure you got the bell on so you're one of the first to type hashtag Hacky Army in the comments. And just before we begin, if you want to see more Garage Wars on the channel, take a second to drop a like on this video. That'd be awesome. Also, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and drop a sub because you do not want to miss any more videos like these. I mean, why not? help us reach a hundred thousand subs that would be much appreciated also don't forget to turn on the notification bell as well real quick if you're in need of any of these gta online services check out the top link of the description and don't forget to use discount code hacky for five percent off at checkout also stop by the new giveaway site for some awesome prizes like xbox series x's ps5s and much more anyway though let's get back into the video now we're going to be checking out spams's garage let's go ahead and take a look so first car we got the d10 in green just a nice subtle green paint job with the snowflake looking benny's wheels not if that's a selected or unselected color it looks like a military type green and then he's got the little baby yankton plate on the back of it so this may be like a wrapper design next up we got the jester with this aqua blue paint job with the ice white benny's wheels and the white on the secondary color i don't see the jester modded often so it's nice to see it modded and he's also got the blankton on the back of it as well which is nice i do like the jester definitely a pretty cool design on it next up we have a beautiful blue paint job on the felter i love these types of hacky blue type paint jobs and he's got the ice white benny's on it as well this is is one of the nicest colors I've seen on a car in GTA 5 online like straight up. Next up we got the Serrano with this modded purple paint job on it. He's also got the purple on that phone wheels and he did say this was an unselected color on the wheels as well which is awesome and then the Blinkton on the back once again. Definitely an awesome and rare modded car right there. Next up we got the Coquette Classic with this awesome looking paint job with of course the invisible back. He's got this modded navy blue color with the bright blue pearlescent and then the marshmallow wheels. Overall just a very nice design on that one. Next up we got the Windsor Drop with this very cool modded green paint job he went with the gold benny's wheels with the green on them obviously to match up with the paint job i do like that a lot another really cool design i'm a big fan of that one gotta say going up to floor number two now we're going to be starting off with a br8 this is an awesome looking f1 car nice choice with the benny's wheels i think they look really clean with this awesome looking paint job this liquid black paint job looks amazing in my opinion next up we got the hellfire he's got the subtle blue paint job with a bright blue pearlescent and then also the matching blue color on the wheels pretty straightforward design he's also got some blue in the interior right there as well next up we have an awesome looking pink paint job on the wagner this bright pink paint job looks awesome and i also like the benny's wheels on it as well he's got the blinkton on the back if you guys can see that right there and then also the ice white on the benny's overall another really nice design next up we got the fudo i don't see the fudo modded too often ice white f ones which look really nice with this paint job and then also the blinkton right there another really cool design on a rare modded car next up we got the krieger he's got this very nice looking black and yellow combo on the paint job and then the ice white benny's I think that's a liquid black on the paint job to be exact. Next one's gonna be the Comet Retro Custom with this like peanut butter type color. Or actually, this gives me more of like a caramel type vibe. So it's like a caramel paint job with this like goldish yellowish pearlescent. He's got the unselected black on the street wheels this time. So nice to see him switch it up a bit. Next up, we have the super light purple color along with like a very, very light blue, I think. Pretty interesting color combo, gotta say. And then the ice white street wheels. Going up to the third and final four, we're gonna be starting off with the GB200. I don't see this car modded too often he's got the sunset orange paint job with the yellowish pearlescent and then also the ice white bennies and the blankton on the back of it another really cool car gotta say next up we got the zion with i think the same paint job i'm not exactly sure if it's the exact same paint job it's another orange paint job gotta say and then i'm not sure if that's a selected or unselected color on the bennies wheels next up we got a black and red combo on the 9f he's got the unselected black on the f1 wheels with the red branding obviously to match it up with this nice looking neon red paint job with i think that's like a very subtle orange per lesson you can see it on some parts of the car a little bit better next up we got the vigera with this neon red paint job with the ice white benny's wheels he's got the blankton on the back of it i don't see this muscle car modded too often either it's not super rare but it's definitely not common i'd say next up we got the glendale though i don't see this car modded like ever very cool looking car with this bright red paint job with the whitish pearlescent and then also the red interior he's got the cheetah print right there which looks really cool and then also the red outline on the bennies and he's got the michael jackson yankton plate on the front of it that's really cool next up we have a really cool paint job on the blade i think this is yeah the blade this gives me like retro type vibes this is a really cool paint job on a really cool car it's like a nice looking purple with i think like an orangish pearlescent it looks a little bit pink too ice white bennies on it of course as well now for the final car we got the tornado rat rod this looks sick i think this is more of like a peach paint job he's got the bennies wheels on the front of it and then the stock wheels in the back and the crazy rustic looking engine on the front of it this one's really really unique your final rating is 
9.2. We got Hearts' his garage next. Let's go ahead and check it out. So first car, we got the Baller LE. He's got this nice looking blue paint job on it. I'm a big fan of this blue color with the ice white Benny's wheels. He's got the blue interior inside. And then let's check out the plate. He's got the Waza Yankton plate on the back right there. Love to see it. Next car, we got the JB700W. This is basically like the 007 car. At least that's what it reminds me of. He's got this pretty basic silver design with the gold Benny's wheels. That actually looks pretty cool. Let's see if we got something on the plate. And no, it's actually just a blank tint on the back, but definitely a pretty cool car. Next up, we have a beautiful blue paint job on the XXR. I love this paint job so much. It looks absolutely awesome. I'm a big fan of this like light blue and white design. Overall though, I do like the design, especially that like sky blue color on that. I think that looks absolutely awesome. Next up, we have more of like a tropical turquoise type color on the Novak. Nice to see the Novak modded. He's got the white pearlescent on it, matching up with the ice by Bendy's wheels on it. Pretty simple turquoise and white design. I do like the Novak as well. Next up, we got the 770 with this very neon red paint job with like the orangish pearlescent. So I think he's going for a lava paint job here. That's what it looks like for the most part. And he's got the black wheels. Not sure if that's selected or unselected. Pretty cool car though. Next up, we got the Issy Sport with F1 wheels. This is more of like a sunset orange type paint job with like the yellowish goldish pearlescent. Red branding on the F1 wheels and then the grotty on the yank to play on the back. Going up to the second floor, we have a beautiful hacky blue type color on the brawler. I rarely see the brawler modded. I'm a big fan of these types of colors as you guys know it's more of like a hacky type blue so i'm gonna take credit for this beautiful looking color and the pretty basic ice by bennies on him as well really cool color next one's gonna be the hot ring saber with this secret gold design on it just the secret gold paint job the secret gold on the wheels pretty much an all secret gold nascar right there next up we got the toros with this like bluish design yeah i think the paint job is more of a blue rather than a purple it looks a little bit purple with the pink paint job on it but he's got the matching blue color on that phone wheels not sure if it's selected or unselected but he's got the matching blue color on the wheels not sure if it's selected or unselected once again next up we got the shafter v12 with this very interesting looking purple color i haven't seen a shade of purple like this in a long time and it's more of like a midnight type purple not exactly though it's a cool color though i do think it fits this car fairly well and then he's got the ice by bennies next up we got a liquid black paint job on the oracle xs i do like the bennies wheels on it as well he's got the tupac yank to play on it so i'm guessing this is meant to be some like tupac design fairly simple design on that next up we got the buffalo with this very nice purple paint job it's like a nice looking purple with like a bright pink paint job and then the blue on the wheels i would have liked it a little bit better if the wheels were like the same purple or pink as on the car it still does look cool though i am a big fan of that paint job next up we have basically an all wine red comet retro custom this looks really cool wine red paint job he's got the red interior and the wine red on the bennies and going up to the third and final floor now we're going to be starting off with a penumbra ff with this like very subtle blue paint job he does have the matching blue collar on the bennies wheels which is really cool and then the blue outline on it which isn't exactly the same shade of blue i wonder what it would look like with no outline or like a white outline on it still a pretty cool design though next up we have this like rose gold paint job on the furia this looks super clean i gotta say especially with the marshmallow wheels on it very nice looking car with a sleek design on it i like it next up we got the jester classic with another like subtle blue type paint job i'd say with the bright blue pearlescent and the ice by bennies on it pretty simple design right there next up we have another baller the baller le armor to be specific he's got this like rose gold paint job once again i'm not sure if it's the exact same paint job as on the furia i think this would have looked a little bit better on the regular baller because i'm not a huge fan of like the armor parts on the sides just because it doesn't look as clean and he's got the white bennies on it next up we got the drafter i've seen this design before it's like a purple crew chrome with a goldish pearlescent with the ice white bennies it is a cool design but i've just seen it before next up we have a really sleek looking paint job on the osiris really sleek looking paint job on a pretty sleek looking car itself and of course with the ice white bennies now for the final car we got the cyclone with this awesome looking paint job it's like a dark aqua green type color with like a blue pearlescent it does look really nice i do like the white stripe going down the middle with the ice by benny's wheels your final rating is 8.6